What's up, everybody? This is Chris with Big Chris Cooks, also from Tales from the Tar Heel State. Podcast available on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and anywhere you watch podcasts. Please uh, remember to subscribe to our channel, click the like button, and all that good stuff. So, today I'm making some meatballs. These are a little bit different than I've made in the past. Um, everything's really expensive these days. Ground turkey was on sale. It's $85.15. And it is, uh, I think it was $8.99 for a three pound pack. So get your price down to, you know, the $3 range. So not too expensive for something when ground beef is really expensive. So we're going to make this a little different, use some different seasonings. It's not going to be Italian style um, here in this mortar and pestle here. I put uh, some sage, dried sage, dried thyme, a teaspoon of each. I got a quarter teaspoon of mustard seed they were whole when I started I ground them up in here I did a uh, half a teaspoon of coriander dry uh, you know and just ground it up in there and a half a teaspoon of white pepper and a half a teaspoon of black pepper now the black pepper and the white pepper were kind of the, the white pepper is pretty easy to, easy to smash in there with the black pepper I, you know, I ground it so we've got three big cloves of garlic here I don't know if you can see these but you'll be able to see all this stuff later somewhere in the video we'll have a picture of this one medium onion, we're going to do one large, extra large egg, a couple of teaspoons of Worcestershire sauce. This is some turkey schmaltz, turkey fat that I had left over from our roasted turkey at Christmas. I had that in the fridge, so it's probably about a little more than a quarter cup, maybe a third of a cup. We're going to add that in there for moisture instead of adding milk to it. And um, this is two thirds of a cup of breadcrumbs. So we're going to put this in this bowl, mix all this up. And uh, make some meatballs. They're not going to be too big. Not that big. Just kidding. Maybe, you know, golf ball size. And then we'll bake them in the oven. We'll make a sauce. And, uh, we'll, you know, through the magic of television, we'll get all this together here and show you through segments. And uh, hopefully we'll have some fun and eat some good food. Before I go to mix all this up, I just want to plug this cutting board. A friend of mine, Brandon, Postal Weight, made this for me. He actually makes a bunch of these. He has a shop that he works out of up in Roxburgh, North Carolina. And um, I'll try to put some information on make these available if somebody's looking for these. I think this one's got walnut strips and uh, I think this is uh, maple maybe. I forget what all kind of wood he used on these. And um, Anyway, I don't know how much he's charging for them. I'll have to find out. But if you're interested in getting one of these, just let me know. Uh, you can check me out on my website. You can leave a comment below on the uh, YouTube channel. And um, I will uh, find out a little more information about that and get it back to you. Okay? All right. Now we'll go back to making these meatballs. <laughs>
so these are going to bake in a 375 degree oven for about 30 to 35 minutes, okay? And that's how many meatballs, you know, maybe a little bit bigger than golf ball size, that three pounds of turkey made. So, there you go. Hmm?